What's going on everyone? Welcome back to another video. Now, if you remember back to a few videos ago, when I did five reasons to buy a Ford Transit Sport, I talked about the fact that you, you could take this on any road with supercars or whatever and I could have as much fun in this thing. So that got us thinking a little bit and the idea behind today's video would be that I was going to take this van to one of my favourite driving roads, yeah, which is really local to me. First of all, just to show you that it is possible to have fun in a Ford Transit and also because it's a spectacular drive up there. Really good. And the views and everything, it's just sensational. I haven't been up in quite a while, so I'm excited. Fingers crossed the weather holds out because it's pretty messy to be honest with you. At the minute, we don't know whether it's going to stay dry, whether it's going to rain. So that is the plan. Now, I'll talk you through the route. We're going to be going up the A69 and then we're going to go from the A69. We're going to head towards Alston and up that way, all the way to the top of Hartside Pass. Now, I believe you're about 1,900 feet up when you're at the peak of Hartside Pass. And it's not, it doesn't just stop at Hartside Pass. It's just kind of a, a point that uh, I like to go to. The whole of the A686 is brilliant to drive. It's just the fact that from mine to Hartside, it's a nice little distance. You get the windy roads in there as well. Some spectacular views when you get the top. And normally if you go on a Sunday, it's pretty busy. I've got a mate of mine coming with me today who's gonna help us out with some camera work and stuff like that. Keep us company on my way up. We've got the GoPro out, so we're going to get some GoPro footage as well, hopefully, of going up. We've got the camera, obviously. I'll do a little bit of talking when we get there. And, uh, yeah, I'll probably speak to you in a bit. I hope you guys enjoy the drive up.
those sexy views. <laughs> Beautiful view. Ah, oh, it's had a mini heart attack, I think. Do you want to be in the video? Uh, whatever. I'll see you. Yeah. Here's my girlfriend. <laughs> So we've made it to the top of Hartside Pass, Hartside Calf. We're going to get out and have a bit of a look about, show you exactly why it's worthwhile coming up to the top of here. No matter what vehicle you're in, there's camper vans, there's an ice cream man that we just overtook over there two seconds ago. We've got a Fiat. What's that? Oh, not a Skoda. Roomster. Roomster. Is it? <laughs> um, this is my cameraman for the day, Nathan, and. Uh, yeah, we'll get out and we'll have a little bit of a wonder. <laughs> GoPro survived as well on the way up. Didn't come off. I thought we'd have to pick it up a few times because the weather wasn't over great when we started coming up. So it's been a fair while since I've been up here and there used to be behind us, there used to be a, a calf, very popular on a Sunday with the bikers and your car enthusiasts, everyone used to come up for a bit, bit food, a um, bit playing the cars and the bikes and now it's all, I don't know what happened to it exactly but it's gone and there used to be a board that told you loads of information about how high up you were and what was around you and there was a telescope where you could put some money in and and have a look at all the scenery and whatnot. What a day, what an absolute day. The weather has just getting better and better as the days went on. I'm absolutely, my skin's leaking. Hang on a sec. What did you think of them roads then? Cause I've had an absolutely amazing trip up there. I love going up every time. But do you know what as well? The footage and the pictures and the videos and also it's like, it doesn't do it justice. You, you can't capture what you see on on camera you just you just can't capture it you you physically have to be there to just see how good the roads are how fun the roads are when you go up you'll understand that please please do have a trip up if you if you've not been or if you've been before then you, you'll know exactly what i'm talking about but it's just incredible the transit sport didn't let with down though did it really fun to drive up them roads really fun i, I told you i told you all i, I said I can have as much fun in this van as you can in any other car on the same roads. And I'm telling you, I've drove Sierra Cosworths up there, Focus RSs, BMWs. Do you know what? The Transit Sport, it did not disappoint. It didn't disappoint. Now, my pal Nathan, he reckons 
that the other side is even better than the side that we went up. Now, I've never been up the other side before. I was honest with him. I said, I've not been up there near. So apparently, we're going to go for a little bit of a, a drive up there at some point in the near future. And I'm going to actually film the other perspective from the other side coming up to the, the Hartside Calf, which will be interesting. He's got a couple of really cool motorbikes, actually, as well. He also has a VW T5. I'm going to link his Instagram uh, on the video as well. So go and check him out. If you're interested in that sort of stuff, successful trip out, great day for it, lovely weather. The weather has just gotten better and better as the days went on. I couldn't have asked for anything more because the weather said it was going to thunderstorm, it was going to rain. The idea behind doing this video was that I wanted to try and make it into, you know, like a little series, like a little episode series where this is the first one. This is a nice local driving road that you can go to and just enjoy yourself on with some brilliant views. But I wanna know where there's more roads like this that I can go and enjoy. Now, to do that, I need your help. You watching the video, yes. I need your help. I need you guys. If you've got some roads, you know, you think are great, leave a comment down below and let us know because I'm gonna do me research on these and potentially I might even go traveling and find these roads and I'm gonna, I'm gonna drive them myself. We're gonna take the transit on a tour of the UK and just visit some of these great driving roads that you guys obviously know of as well. Thank you so much for watching again, guys. I really do appreciate it. We're really, really close to a thousand subscribers. 1,000 subscribers. If you do enjoy the content, make sure to leave a like, share as well if you can, Leave a comment down below and let us know what your favorite driving road is, where it is, give us a postcode, something that I can do some research on. And if you suggest the road, the specific roads as well, then maybe we'll meet up and we'll drive up the roads together or something like that, just to make it a little bit more fun, a little bit more interesting, keep everybody involved as much as possible. I've really enjoyed doing this video, guys. It's been a lot of fun. Fingers crossed there's some more like this to come. Let us know if there's any specific type of videos that you guys want to see. The more feedback, the more comments, just the better, really. Remember to follow on Instagram as well. If you're not already, I will leave a link down below. I'm going to leave it there, guys. Have a fantastic rest of your day. Enjoy the rest of your week, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.